warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Ahmad Ami Amza, and today I'll be presenting about my project for instrumentation. So here is my project, and this is my housing. Here is the box cell that I use. This is the breadboard, and I use only one operational amplifier, and there are four resistors, which is two of them are 300 kilo ohm, while the other two is one kilo ohm. And here is the Arduino Uno, which is connected to the laptop. For obtaining the value of the sensitivity of the load and also for the offset, we'll be using this coding to make the computer display the analog output when we put the load on the load cell. Now, as we can see, there are no load on the load cell. So when we read the value of the analog output in the laptop, the value is around 590. Next, I will demonstrate when we put 0.5 kilograms on the load cell, the value of the analog output in the laptop is 608, which is higher than before. As you can see from the previous example, when we increase the value of the load on the load cell, the value of the analog output is also increasing. So, to obtain more accurate value of the load cell and also the sensitivity of the load cell, I will repeat the same steps with other weight, which is 1.5 kilograms, 2 kilograms, up until 4 kilograms. And then I will tabulate all the data in the Microsoft Excel and plot the graph to obtain the value, to obtain the equations of the graph. So after we manage to obtain all of the value of the analog output up until 4 kilograms, so we plot the graph and the equation of the graph we obtain is y is equal to 34.667x plus 591 which means our offset value is 591 and our sensitivity of the load cell is 34.667 and then we change our offset and sensitivity value in the coding now I will test for 1 kilogram, so I will add on more 0 0.5 kilograms on the load cell. So it displays the value of the weight value is 1.04 kilograms. And then when I add more 0 0.5 kilogram, which is total on the load cell is 1.5 kilogram. So it displays around 1.53 kilograms. So it is quite close to 1.5 kilograms, which means there are still error. But then, when I measure the weight on the digital scale, the actual weight for this dumbbell is not 0 0.5 kilograms, which means there are defects on this load. So it might lead to the error that present on the computer. So that's all for my presentation for my projects. Thank you and assalamualaikum.